Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a mukbang story time. But yeah, that's what I'm going to be doing. Because I'm hungry. So I'm also filming videos today. So I figured why not make a video out of it. Also, sorry if you pick up on like how harsh <laughs> this contour line is. Um, I didn't realise that until now looking in the camera. So oopsies. I've got the Jack's Clicks um, with... French onion dip, tasty cheese, and cabanossi. Yeah, that's what this is going to be consisting of. I love cabanossi. So I'm going to get right into that. This story time is... Oh, they're all connected. Okay. This story time is about how um, I got detention on my birthday. Yep, that happened. That was a really annoying period in my life. So good. So good. This was, I believe, when I was in year eight. Mm -hmm. I was in year eight. And um, at the school, we had Tuesday as sport days. And if you got in trouble during sport, the following Tuesday, you wouldn't be allowed to do sport and you would have um, Tuesday sport detention. So, that's where this is headed. I had Tuesday sport detention for the most annoying, aggravating reason, but whatever. Let me explain. Okay, so let me explain what happened. <laughs> Jeez, I'm afraid it's gonna be really hard to film because I don't like talking with my mouth full. And that's what people do in these videos, so it's gonna be really hard for me. And it's also really gross, so sorry, but you clicked on it knowing what it was. Um, anyways, so what happened was my birthday just so happened to be on a Tuesday. Great, okay? Great start to the video. Um, the Tuesday before my birthday, one week until my birthday, I was at sport, you know, as per usual. And I don't really remember what sport was. I just know it was off school grounds, so we had to come back from sport. And um, we were coming in through the gates. When I say we, I mean me and my two friends. We were coming in through the gates. And I knew, generally speaking, that you had to get your name marked off once you came back into school grounds. But this one day, everyone was coming in. And because, you know, the bell had gone, everyone's going to the bus bays, whatever. Um, like I said, the bell had gone and my bus, I needed to catch my bus home, otherwise I wasn't getting home, or I had to walk home. And um, the bell had gone when we got through the gate, so everyone started panicking and running to the bus space. I obviously did the same thing, started panicking like I'm gonna miss my bus, and started running to the bus space. There was a few select people, maybe five or so people from my class, which was a big class, so it was probably a class of like 50 or so people, that actually went to the classroom and got their name marked off which in my opinion was the biggest waste of time because I didn't have time to get my name marked off when I was about to miss my bus home so priorities you know and you know more than half of my class ran to the bus bays this makes me so angry half of my class more than half of my class ran to the bus bays got the bus home didn't think much of it you know teacher can figure it out they have we uh, we had our names marked off before we left and you know we all returned for all that whatever so the next week comes and it's my birthday and i'm really looking forward to sport because i can't i still can't remember what it was but i remember really enjoyed it um i know it was something on frost reserve but i really enjoyed it and i was really looking forward to sport and i was heaps excited blah blah blah, blah. and then Sport time comes. 
So we go to the classroom to get our names marked off before sport. And then a teacher comes in and calls me out and um, talks to me and tells me, I'm not going to sport because I didn't get my name marked off last time. One time I did not get my name marked off. So I have sport detention. So my whole day was ruined and I was like, wow, it's literally my birthday. Like, can't you do this next week? Like, oh my gosh. No, I don't care if it's your birthday. You didn't get your name marked off. Okay, just keep that there. I didn't get my name marked off. Just remember that I said over half my class didn't get my name marked off, but I didn't get my name marked off, okay? I've never done anything wrong. I've never had detention before, but I didn't get my name marked off. I was, you know, whatever. So I went to sports detention and one period was in um, a maths classroom and one period was in a science classroom. I'm not eating. So, it's really hard for me to talk and eat. I don't think this is going to work out. Whatever. It's more just going to become a story time. And me cutting out when I'm eating. <laughs> Anyways. Um, so I went to the classroom, the math classroom, and sat down there expecting to see, you know, the other 75% of my class sitting there. Nope. Just me. From my whole class. Mind you, I said earlier that I was walking through the gates with my two friends. They weren't there. They didn't get sports attention. The other 75% of my class weren't there. I think there was actually one other person. But this particular person, I'm obviously not going to name names. This particular person was someone who got detention really often. So like it didn't surprise me because it could have been for any other reason as well. I was the only one out of the 75% of my class that didn't get my name marked off on my birthday to get sports detention. The only one. Wow, your system's a bit flawed, isn't it? So instead of, you know, giving me a warning for the first time I've ever gotten detention in school before, the first time I've ever messed up or whatever, the first time, how many times I'm gonna say that? Instead of getting a warning, I got sports detention when no one else who didn't get their name marked off did. How does that even happen? Like, I don't understand what goes through someone's head to be like, all these names on the roll have an X next to them because they didn't come. Oh, we're gonna pick this one to get attention. Like, what? Where the heck is your head at? Like, oh my God, I was so livid when I saw that no one else in my class was there. Oh, it still makes me angry. Um, so then, so then, with the teacher that I was with, the math teacher, I knew her, I had her, she was my teacher um, for math, and um, yeah, so that detention was fine, you just sat there and did call for 50 minutes, you sat in a plastic chair at a wooden desk doing nothing for 50 minutes, that was your punishment, you just had to sit there and be bored out of your mind, whatever, so then, the bell goes, went to the next classroom, because it was their turn to supervise, and it was a science classroom. Now, this particular teacher, I'm just going to say it, it was Mr. Stanley. Um, I had in year 11 and 12, but before then I didn't really know who he was because I had never had him before. Um, I love Mr. Stanley now, and like he's literally could be like another dad to me, like he was so lovely to me in year 11 and 12 and like I care so much for him but in year eight when um that sports detention I didn't really know who he was and <laughs> I just remember being in that detention being terrified because he was yelling at everyone for having a sports detention or whatever and saying how like irresponsible and whatnot we are and all that sort of stuff so then he eventually got to me and asked me why I had sports detention and I told him I didn't get my name. No, I think he said, I think he was marking the role and because it's on Millennium, you can see when it's someone's birthday, whatever. And he mentioned to me like, oh, it's your birthday, you know, like that sucks, blah, blah. And then later on, he came to me saying what I got, what I was in detention for. And I said, I didn't get my name marked off. 
along with so many other people in my class, but I'm the one who got detention on my birthday. And I just remember him yelling at me. And it was so stupid. Like, I didn't get my name marked off because I was going to miss my bus. Like, oh my god. Biggest freaking sin in the world. Wow. But, um, yeah, he was just yelling at me saying, you know, how stupid of an excuse that was and that I was going to miss my bus. Um, and like, I don't know, just, I can't remember because I like blocked it out because like that was traumatizing to me like that. Really hurt. Um, because again, 75% of my class didn't get detention and he's just yelling at me because I did it. Like, I've never got in trouble in my life. Whatever. Anyways, moving on. It's just going to make me more heated. Um, I love you now, Stanley, but um, then I definitely didn't. Um, and yeah, he was just saying like, pretty mean stuff, but like, when he loses his temper, he loses his temper. I know that. <laughs> Again, I had him for two years, so I know exactly what it looks like when he loses his temper. But in, in year 11 and 12, I was definitely one of his favourites. Sorry to offend anyone that was in my physics class, but he definitely treated me very special because of my life circumstances and what home life was like. That's why if anyone watches this, I was in my physics class, I always wondered why I'd be pull a, pulled aside by him and how you'd see me and him walk back into the classroom crying. It's because I would open up to him outside of the classroom, tell him what had been happen happening and um, update him on home life. And um, yeah, it would always make him cry because he always felt so bad for me. So um, yeah, I love Stanley now. Um, but yeah, he was just very mean back then because I was scared I was going to miss my bus. But you know, it's whatever. Um, I didn't really eat much in this video. <laughs> but that's okay. But yeah, that's basically the story of how I got detention on my birthday. Dumbest thing ever. It still makes me angry to this day because my whole... 14th birthday was ruined because of that because I went home really upset from Stanley yelling at me and stuff like that like it really stuck with me and um yeah really hurt because I didn't understand why I was getting so incredibly punished when everyone else didn't get anything at all um so yeah that was definitely a big wake up call definitely went to every other getting your name marked off after that and I did miss my bus a few times in that particular term um, because yeah we'd always arrive back at school late so annoying so yeah there were quite a few times where I did have to walk home but I went and got my name marked off didn't I so yeah that happened and yeah that's just basically this video I hope you enjoyed it <laughs> um, I didn't but that's okay. So, yeah. Alrighty guys, that's it for today's video. Be sure to give it a like and share this video. If you're new to the channel, you should hit the red subscribe button down below to make it turn grey. The extra addition of the letter D at the end as well. I upload videos every Sunday and sometimes Wednesday. So be sure to turn on post notifications to be alerted to those up and coming videos. As well as following my social medias to be alerted on there also. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you. And don't forget, everything is going to be okay in the end. And if it's not okay, it's not the end. Cue the outro.